I forgot to press record, but here we go again. <laughs> Hello everyone, a very good morning. So today, I'm going to talk about something that's been viral among the Malaysian, among the Malaysians. Yeah, I've been, I've been a bit late, but let me see. This is what we call kick tapak kuda, which basically means the feet of a horse cake. Cake of a feet horse. I don't know, I don't know why it's that's the name or how you exactly pronounce it but basically if a trouser is basically the feet of a horse it's this like this big i am small by the way i am a very small person and for this thing to cost you about 15 to 20 ringgit which basically translates to around the lighting's really bad which basically translates to around 5 dollars yeah, this thing will cost you about up to four to five dollars. Like, let that sink in. This thing will cost you five dollars. Like, fuck off, man. Five dollars could break, could give you like two days worth of meal. How about the ingredients? You might say, like, I don't know. I've never tested it out. My mom bought this, and I was like, okay, let me give this a try, then. So yeah, this is my honest opinion. This is the cut, cut version of it. Because, yeah, my mom only bought two because how expensive this thing is. <laughs> Let's give it a dig. Bismillah. So, there's like this cake right here. And if you can see, there's this cake right here. And it's like green and like black. What well, I'm assuming there's like chocolates, the cakes, and this pistachio, I think. Not pistachio, I don't know. Let's give it, Let's give it a dig. Bismillah. Oh, it's like crunchy. So, this is just Nestum, just cornflake, cornflakes, but in green thing, in green, I don't know what you call it, but it's basically just cornflakes with Nutella, and it's like a sponge cake, that's it. You could probably make this yourself for less than five dollars, that's what I can say, or five dollars could probably just make, give you like or if food long or something. I'm not impressed by this. I'm not impressed by this. It's really bad. Like for the price, it's bad. Like it's good. Don't get me wrong. It tastes good, but for the price, no. I am someone who bakes occasionally. I bake for my father's birthday cake. I bake my father's birthday cake for his birthday. So I know how to make things. And for this thing to be this expensive, hell no. Like, fuck off, what are you, British or something? Like, that seems like crazy. Now, this don't taste good for the price, no? Mm. If you're wondering why I'm still eating it, it's because I'm Asian, okay? As an Asian, we don't waste our food. We eat all of them until it's empty, until the plate's clean, like you wash it in your fucking dishwasher. By the way, I have the dishwasher.
Yeah, I'm still gonna say it's not good. So, what's my verdict? Zero out of ten. Come on, Malaysia, you could do something very more and better. This shit is a trend. Nah. Imagine if I have a mic, right? So it's, it will just be like ASMR. Crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, I'm lost of words. I'm just wasting your time right here, but yeah. Let's kick the baku there, the feet of a horse cake. That's not that good. Don't buy it. Don't waste your money. Like, if you want to buy if you, if you want to eat it, just make it yourself, man. It's way more worth it. It's not even that hard to make. Just buy a freaking sponge cake somewhere. Yeah, this chocolate thing you see here, this is just fucking Nutella. Like a fucking Nutella. It's like this, and you put it in this. It's like having a bread, you put this, and you put cornflakes with a bit of sugar in it. Yeah, you're welcome. I just taught you how to make it yourself. I'm disappointed. My day is ruined. I'm gonna go live for I'm just gonna go like full, full out studying mode after this. Oh, I forgot I'm cooking right now. But yeah, have a nice day, everyone. Bye bye. Assalamualaikum.